Hello, welcome to Fame Ebong TV. Today, I will be showing you guys a demonstration video on how to produce soda soap. There is a popular soap in Nigeria called soda soap or saika, depending on your region or location. This soap has a lot of names in Nigeria and across is known as soda soap in my area and most people call it the saika soap so it depends on your area i'm sure in other places the name of the soap differs so i want to show you a demonstration video on how this soap is produced then if you want to produce the soap in in a larger quantity you can do well by checking the de description of this video I will drop recipes for those that want to produce this soap called soda soap or saika soap. I will be dropping recipe, a recipe for those that want to produce this in a larger, for I me mean for a larger production. So watch this video and follow the steps I will be using. Now this soap is actually very easy to make because it make make use it actually makes use of fewer ingredients. It make, makes use of the caustic soda, the water, the oil, and color. So next thing I want to be doing is to um, prepare my color. Over here is my color. I'm making use of a white color. This color is actually water soluble, implying that this color has to be dissolved in water. This one cannot be dissolved in oil. Like I said before, when you go to buy color or purchase color for your soap production, find out what type of color is that. Try to know if it is a water soluble color or an oil soluble color. Oil soluble color dissolves in oil. Water soluble colors dissolve in water.
so before you pour your soap into this um, soap mold that i'm pouring my soap into make sure you oil it i forgot to show how i oiled mine you just use small oil small of your oil to oil this mold so that you can remove it from the you can remove the soap out of the mold easily you have to first of all oil the, your soap mold this soap mold is actually sold where they sell plastics just go to the market where they sell plastics plenty plastics they will have these containers for sale this container they usually in pack packaging things like the shea butter or peanut granite it's actually a plastic it's popular in the market just go to where they sell plastics in the market you will find this kind of containers to use for your soda soap for your soda soap mode or your cycle soap mode don't forget that you have to oil this mode before pouring your soap into it first of all use a little quantity of your oil you can be granite oil or your palm kernel oil rub the mold with oil inside of the mold rub it with oil so that when you are removing the soap or when the soap gets hard it won't be difficult to remove it from the mold if you don't oil this mold removing this soap will be difficult the soap will eventually come out but it will be difficult to remove because you didn't oil it so make sure you oil it before pouring your soap inside Also, don't forget to join my online class. Check the description of this video. You will find a link where you can join my online classes where I teach people how to make different skincare production. You will learn a lot. And don't forget to purchase my ebooks. Check or if you want to join my class, if you have difficulty joining through the link, reach me on the phone number displayed on the screen of this video to join the class. You can reach me on WhatsApp to be added to my online class. Okay, so after 24 hours, this is the result of my soap. This is how it looks like after 24 hours. You can see it is very hard. So I'm going to take it out of the soap mold. I will take them out one after the other. So thank you for watching this video don't forget to share don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe to the channel don't forget to share this video to those that you think will want to learn this skill of soda soap or psycho soap production share it to your mothers your aunties people that you know will want to be producing soda soap but they don't know how to start or how to go about it this is a simple demonstration video on how to do this Thank you for watching this video and see you next time on my next video. Goodbye. Don't forget to join my online class to learn more about soap making. And lastly, don't forget to purchase ebooks from me. Goodbye. I'll see you next time.